Welcome to my channel. It's me, Steph Smed, that one crazy teacher. If you are new here, welcome. I hope that you stick around by hitting that subscribe button. And don't forget to hit the bell so you are notified each time I upload a new video. Sorry for my distraction. I got a text, so I was looking at that. Um, if you are already a subscriber, thank you so much from the bottom of my heart for co coming back to my channel and watching me. It means a lot to me. So as you can tell, I'm already very distracted. It's the first day back from break. It is January 3rd. So we have a teacher work day and then tomorrow is professional development day for us teachers. Um, I already did do a professional development today. So thank goodness I don't have to blah, blah. Okay, sorry. <laughs> the first day after the holiday break. Anyways. I'm glad I took it because it was a lot of information. I really enjoyed it. However, I don't have to take it tomorrow, so I have one less for tomorrow. So all I've done today is I have filed all of my IEPs. I am a special education teacher currently, so I made sure all my IEPs were filed that I'd done last semester. Um, and then I took the professional development. I changed my calendar from December to January. And then I looked for some activities for my students. Um, since they come back Wednesday, we'll have Wednesday, Thursday, and then they will have freedom Friday on Friday. So I didn't want to get into something new. Um, we are going to be starting figurative language very soon, but I didn't want to start it with them only having two days. These are different things I have found on Teachers Pay Teachers. Um, it is a pre-writing outline for goals. And I really liked it. I have some students that um, have a hard time with writing. And I thought that this would be great. Because it has checklists and everything. I also found this where it is a word. Um, I'm not going to give them this part. They're just going to, I'm just going to copy this part. And they will just come up with a word. And three things I will do to make it that way. And then I found this. We did something similar last year and this as well then here's this and then in the new year and then they can write about it or they can write about their resolutions now I know that was a lot of different activities and not every class is going to do all of those activities um, I do teach 6th, 7th, and 8th grade ELA, 6th, 7th, and 8th grade history, and then I have them all mixed up for unique skills. So I technically have seven different subjects within five class periods. Um, so there is that. So the pre-writing uh, outline for the goals will be for the ELA, obviously, and I'll probably do it for 6th, 7th, and 8th grade. Um, for history i will probably do one of the other things and then for unique skills i will do something else probably like that word and then another thing so that is what we're going to be doing this week and i just wanted to say i know that i have not posted that many teacher videos this year um it's just when i get to school i hit the ground running i get going uh, throughout the day most of the time I do not have a chance to pick up the camera and record anything uh, I've been working during lunches technically I've not I, I've okay I teach behavioral students so to prevent from behaviors and giving me the ability to eat lunch at the same time the students have been eating lunch in here so I don't have the lunches to record during that time and then during planning I am either helping next door um, having meetings IEPs trying to get copies grades done whatever I need to do but that is why I have not recorded a lot of teaching videos this semester I have noticed I've noticed some of the stuff is starting to come off so I will need my son to come and um, hot glue the stuff that I can't reach like way up there so hopefully most of it will stay up but this is what my classroom looks right now look looks like 
how it looks. So yeah, I need to fix that corner. Then that poster's coming off. There's the calendar I fixed. Ah, uh, fine. The months do not want to stay on here for some reason. But this, I noticed, is coming off of that corner. Oh, so anyways, this is what it looks like right now. That is staying, and I don't know why that's staying, and nothing else seems to be staying. So, I don't know. But that is what it looks like right now. So one thing I am going to be doing before the kids come back from break is I'm going to take everything out of their folders. I have put that there so you guys can't see the names. Um, but I will be taking all their stuff from last semester out of their folders. I still need to make coffees, but there was a huge line for the coffee. So I will see if I can squeeze it between some PDs tomorrow. Um, I was trying to look for my email uh, so I can figure out which PDs I want to take and it was going to be in person but now it's all going to be virtual so that works for me because i can do things around the classroom tomorrow so hopefully my kids are worried my own personal children they're worried that we're going to go back virtual and my son especially is worried because he's a senior this year and then my daughter's worried because she's part of theater and actually my son is one of her assistants for the play for the first play that they're doing and um, she's worried that they will have to cancel the show but I think I'm hoping that if we were going to go virtual that they would have said something today I don't know if there's gonna be a phone call out later today to parents so I will find out for sure then what my district is planning on doing because there's been a, a rise in COVID cases again but I'm just thinking they're just probably going to offer the shields again like what I have on my desk except for I took off that so I could see the screen without any interruption I'm thinking I might take off the other top pieces too I haven't made up my mind yet but yeah my hair I need to dye my hair but I'm just lounging today and my what I'm wearing I'm just wearing my hoodie it's for the school and just getting some stuff done. I probably need to clean, but if we're doing virtual PDs tomorrow, then I will probably just do it that way. But, sorry that was a phone call. Um, but anyways, that is what I am doing um, for this week. And then I wanna try, try really hard to make at least one teacher video a week, whether it's outfit of the day or um, what we are doing, whatever, I will try to share that with everybody. So anyways, I hope that you enjoyed this video. Thanks for watching. Have a great day and God bless. And if you like this video, please leave a like, comment, and subscribe. Bye. Thank <laughs> you.